Greetings and welcome to this brand new video. Did you know that with iOS 26, you can turn any app website into a proper full screen native like app without those safaris, address bars. And the good thing is that if you reopen it, it will not reload. It will open from where you left it, unlike the previous iOS versions where it will reload and ruin your experience. Now let's see what I'm talking about. For this demo, I will open Safari and head to youtube.com. You see it is now open. Now to run it as a web app, simply hit these three dots, then hit share, then hit more or these three dots then hit add to home screen and make sure open as a web app button is on you can name it whatever you like i will leave it on default and then hit add now let's close out of safari and open this app or the web app you can see it opened just like a native app and if i close it and reopen it you can see it does not reload same is the case if you are watching a video now let me quickly search for my channel i will scroll it a little bit so that you can see it does not reload i will close it reopen it you can see it opens from where i left it off yes you can sign in on your web apps without issues this will be beneficial when in the future these apps lose compatibility on older devices which will be in the future end of life on ios 26 or any other version after ios 26 and you will be able to run these just like native apps without issues now i will leave it here and i will fill the ram to see if it reloads all right now let's open it. No reloads, no issues. The same case goes with other app websites. All right. And we have another one. Make sure this button is on, add. And let's test another one. Add to home screen and hit add. Now let's open it. You can see they open just like native apps without issues. No issues whatsoever. Just like that. Before we end the video, what about the YouTube web app? Did it reload? No, it is working without issues. Same case goes with ChatGPT. Hit on add and open it from here. You can see it opens just fine like the native app. No issues whatsoever. Now, if you want to delete them, you can simply press and hold and then hit delete bookmark to remove them. That's all for this video, guys. If you still have questions, please ask in the comment section and I will reply you as soon as possible. I will see you in a new video. Goodbye and take care of yourself.